Hello everyone, Style and Steve back here again with another Cards Against Humanity review. The Bigger Blacker box is out one more time, and we know that means there's an updated set, which was delivered to me today, which you can see here. Just took it right out of the mailbox. This is the Absurd box from Cards Against Humanity, their latest and greatest, we hope. 300 new cards for the set, and uh, I'm going to do this just completely and totally 100% live. My scissors are not the sharpest, but it's only opening an envelope live on screen. I have the Absurd Box from Cards Against Humanity. And I don't know if you're picking it up on camera, but this is a very, very trippy box. And it'll probably get even trippier when I take the plastic off here. The Absurd Box contains 300 all-new cards that came to us after taking peyote and wandering the desert. This box is weirder, dumber, and more whimsical than anything we've written before. And I'm excited to get into it. Some examples there on the bottom of the potential cards and combinations. But without further ado, am I going to need my cutting utensil or am I just going to fight with the cellophane? I can fight with cellophane, and I can win. That's a sticker on the butt. What? Do they double wrap it? Apparently it may be double wrapped in cellophane. That's one layer off. That could be why it was so trippy to look at. Aha! It was an optical illusion created by the cellophane. Those crafty buggers. Yeah, you can see it's, it's, it's just the cellophane overlapping it to make... Well, the top layer was clear, but it's just the cellophane overlapping to uh, create an illusion and hurt my eyes. Also, apologies if you can hear a chainsaw going. That's my neighbors cutting up some wood for their uh, wood stove. They got about a quart of wood in yesterday, so they've decided that today would be the best time to cut some of it up. All right, so we have the illusory wrappings off, and we just have the standard black absurd box. I was kind of hoping it was different. 100% cards against, 100% genuine cards against Bulbenby. Hmm. I don't know how well you can make that out on camera. Oh well. Let's see what we got. The trippiness continues on the side of the box. And we have a whole bunch of white cards and some black cards. And I don't know if we have any blank cards or not. So. As I am off to do... Ooh. There's something extra here. Something extra here. What is this? We finally had a good idea for a new game. It's probably coming out in 2019. If you want us to contact you exactly one time when this game is released, and then permanently delete your email address, sign up at www.dreadfulbookofquestions.horse. I'm going to do that when I get off this video. As soon as I finish recording, I'm going to go sign up. If they're coming out with a new game, I want in on it, because I have everything here. So... Will we start with the white? Will we start with the black cards? Let us start with the black cards. I'll lay the white cards aside for now. They can just chill out there. I'm going to bump my camera. And I'm not going to read out all of these, because depending on some of the language, but you can read and have fun, and uh, YouTube will not get annoyed as annoyed with me that way. And I may not get flagged. Let's see. Why my mustache smells so bad? Yeah, that's so hot. I'm so close. Talk about blank. <laughs> Seriously, guys, there's nothing funny about. One, two, three, and to the four. Snoop Doggy Dog and Dr. Dre is... What's well, hot, smelly, and about to die? The sequel is here. Get ready for blank two. What has my life become? I'm to a video called Co-Ed Absolutely Destroyed By... 
I swear to God, I'm going to murder my husband if he doesn't shut the about. You city folk would never understand the quiet dignity of... Oh, the weather outside is frightful, but is so delightful, and I can't carry a note in my head. But it's Christmas time, so this one's fitting. Hello? <laughs> Goodbye? Hello. It's late at night, you're in bed with your lover, Patrick Stewart. He leans over with a twinkle in his eye and asks, how about? What's you up, YouTube? User Dan the Man wanted to see. So here we go. I so drunk, I... It's finally happening. I'm finally doing it. Yes, it's time for... Sweetheart, you and your sister excel in different ways. She's got her violin, and you've got... Dude, you've got to go to space. Blank is awesome in space. Why did the chicken cross the road? Why did it take him until the absurd box to get to this question? Say it loud. I'm blank, and I'm proud. I'm blank. Oh, you have to see this new documentary on Netflix. I don't want to give anything away, but let's just say it will change the way you look at... Ladies and gentlemen, I propose a two-pronged plan. The first prong will be... And the second prong will be... I have solved politics. My solution is... Kill them all? No. In Radiohead's new single, Tom York repeats the phrase dozens and dozens of times over a skittering drumbeat. Oh no, here it comes. Oh god, it's... You can call me David Copperfield, because I'm about to make blank disappear. Personal foul, 15-yard penalty, automatic first down. That's bullshit. They can't fire me for... Millions of copies sold. Donald Trump's the art of... Ain't it nifty? Barb and Bob hit 50, so get off your ass and raise a glass to 50 years of... Times have changed, girlfriend. If you want to meet people in New York, you gotta be down for... What sounds great after four margaritas? Five margaritas? Rub-a-dub-dub, -dub, blank in a tub. What's secretly a Russian plot to destabilize the West? Five margaritas? I hate this job, I hate this place, most of all, I hate... I quit. For hunting in the King's Forest, I hereby sentence you to death by... Snoo Snoo. There better be a Snoo Snoo card in there. Unfortunately, no one can be told what blank is. You have to experience it for yourself. It's the 21st century. A woman shouldn't have to apologize for blank. Anything, really. Live from Universal Studios, it's America's favorite game show. Or... Give me 10 good men, 48 hours, and I'll get you... Hey, honey, for the bedroom, if you were thinking Robin's Egg Blue or pink. Here's a little something I learned in business school. The customer is always... Goldfinger. He's the man with... New at TGI Fridays, it's what you've been waiting for, the Blank Burger. In bookstores now, from blank to blank, a memoir. And finally, five, four, three, two, one, liftoff. That's the black cards in the absurd box. Not really absurd. I am surprised it did take them that long to get to why did the chicken cross the road. Like, that should have been in their first set. All right, so we have a lot of white cards. Uh, I will try and divide them up into manageable piles. If this game doesn't give you the piles, you are not trying hard enough. So I'm going to separate them into four piles, roughly even, possibly, I hope, maybe. Maybe not. Some piles will be more even than others. But that's the way communism works. I mean, capitalism, maybe? Let's see where we go. Okay. <laughs> There's a place to start. Uh, <laughs> shit. Wow. Okay. Doing it doggy, no kissing. Acquiring a gun very easily. Putting dirty dishes in the sink and hoping someone else deals with them. I don't have roommates, so I have no choice in that. Having 30 sons named Chad. Certain things, but not others. Okay. Wow. Um, technically, it's a, clo a cloaca, I think, but okay. What looked like a chemical weapons facility, but turned out to be a children's hospital. There's a mistake. Free two-day shipping with Amazon Prime. Quality, affordable menswear. Bipolar disorder. 
doing stuff bad. Life. The wonderful giant spoon known as Ladle. Thumb, the king of the fingers. A big hot fire that's burning everybody. Yogurt that moans in pleasure as you eat it. Wow. Not being a part of my son's life. Uncut. <laughs> Thoughts and prayers. This this is the this is the theme of 2018. This 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 sums up 2018. The dumpster fire that was thoughts and prayers. Panda Express. A real job with insurance and your taxes taken out and everything. I have one of those. Big beefy baseball boys. Having no legs, just toes. Awkward. Leading children around with a magical flute. Of course. Fresh air with Terry Gross. Looking the toilet as mistress commands. Swordplay. A bear. Staying hydrated. Murdering our parents. Yummy, 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 yummy. Mm. All types of girls, even the ugly ones. Small plates. Or tapas, if you will. Drake. A racist boomerang that comes back only if you're white. Accusing a powerful man of sexual assault. The pleasure of watching my boys wolf down my pot roast and scamper into the woods. Suddenly feeling really sad for 40 years. I turned 40 in November. It wasn't suddenly feeling sad for the last 40 years. This kid I found. Trees with human skin. Ew. Chinese people. Country music legend Toby Keith. My wife! Respecting women. Pretending golf is fun. I can't pretend that. Colluding with Russia. Nipples the size of CDs. That's some pretty serious nipples. The worm that ate my... God almighty. Okay. Representing the entire black community. Healthcare.gov. A Pringle. A piping hot casserole filled with beans and hair. A four-hour depression nap. I've had those. Funneling money through a series of shell companies. Being seen reading Infinite Jest. Melania Trump. Hard-hitting investigative journalism. Women in positions of power. My buddy Jeff. Because <clears throat> why not? Uh, what? Okay. Outdated gender norms. King of the Jews. The Incredible Gary. He'll suck your nipples. Getting Mommy another beer. New DNA evidence exonerating O.J. Simpson. I don't think that exists. That is pile one. And I'm not keeping track of how many I'm counting. I'm not even counting. Pile number two. In we go. Clearly asking for no cucumbers in my salad, and yet here we are. Hoop Nugget, the game where you throw a nugget in a hoop. Pretty self-explanatory. Pissing me pants. Baseball that screams every time it gets bounced. <laughs> Okay. Uncles. Sandwich. Bimpy, the small styrofoam ball we all jack off into. A cat with hands. Really? Turning poor people against each other so they don't pay attention to economic equality. It's working well in the States. A sticky tree hole full of pancake sauce. Some light choking. Getting herpes from Ruth Willis. Driving to a Walmart parking lot and staring into the distance for eight hours. The rock after which Dwayne Johnson was named. Powerful a philosopher named Brainhead. A big hole. Kanye West, but if you were an old Japanese farmer. Your little booty in them underpants. Reparations for slavery. Death. Beef. All manner of horrors. Death, beef, and all manner of horrors. Sounds like a good name for a novel. Hmm. Non-sexual activities such as roller skating. A big, 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 and I mean big, big. A concerning amount of white people. Tiny sour kisses from a lemon dwarf. A big sloppy blowjob from a mean, tired cowboy. Pulling bu the butt cheeks apart so the fart comes out quieter. Being shitty to everyone and late for everything. Acting white. Setting boundaries with co-workers. Throwing a man by his big penis. Substituting sweet potato fries for two bucks. Worth the two dollars. My secret butt. The moon. Getting tanned, jacked, and juicy. The asshole destroyer 3000. Good, clean Christian comedy. The asshole destroyer 3000. Sorry. Couldn't resist. Curly fry so good you quit ISIS. 
a button that when you press is it? There's jazz. Sticking my hard... Oh my god, almighty. Thrusting and grunting. Canada's worst mangoes. I don't know if we can technically grow mangoes up here. I thought we'd just import them. Three men and three hot dogs. Crunchy snacks for my big flappy mouth. Going oink oink like a nasty pig boy. Yo stanky ass. Interrupting women. Denying climate change. Blowing into the penis that the balls inflate. We're having a wonderful time at the zoo. There was panic and confusion, and a crab rangoon. A garbage clown who makes no one laugh and should die. My real dad. Being inside me. That beautiful backpacks of Jansport. Some cracker-ass motherfucker. That would be me reading these cards. If you do this, you're bad, and you should feel bad. And you should learn from your experiences on how to be better. Nobody should be bad at this. Ever. Well, shit. Corn, the NRA, and Deja Vu. Did I do this before? Anyway. That is pile number two of four here. I'll lay that up out of the way. Three. It's like a bag of pool balls. Clippy from Microsoft Office. Clippy's dead. Dating a Republican is like Clippy from Microsoft Office. A full-on panic attack. Magic the Gathering. A Christmas feast of goose and jellies. Having tuna sa sandwiches with my favorite honkies. A penis so that gets too hard and now. The Audi sign and drive sales event. A little sewer girl strangling a pigeon. Heartwarming. Voter suppression. Loving America. You got to got gotta give it time. Big Italian women making the spicy sauce. Joyless wooden Soviet toys. Getting hashtag me too'd. The persecution of Buddhists by American backed government of South Vietnam. It's political. The express written consent of the National Basketball Association. Maybe getting a little too involved in selling heroin sometimes. Stapling a butterfly to a cow. An ambitious woman who wears pants. A little taste of penis. Just, just a little taste of penis. Cultural appropriation. How quiet the forest is. A magician fucking up over and over again. <laughs> Letting this... Okay. <laughs> wow. I... I mean, you could make a living with that. A bold red lip. Boring-ass white pig from work. 800-foot-long pool noodle. How many bagels can I fit on my penis? The awesome power of the Lord. Owing a lot of money to some very bad people. Violating the Geneva Convention. Assembling Ikea furniture. By f no, that doesn't fit. Mark Zuckerberg. Is Voldemort. No, he's not. Carlos Santana's horrible wailing guitar. I do not agree. Santana makes his guitars sing, and it is amazing. An elite squad known as the Special Victims Unit. Foul vegan shits. Blue smoke coming out of my anus. Should get that checked. My son's dipshit friends. Square dancing with other racists. These breasts are mine. The little known fact that Polish people don't dream. What? All my dead sisters. Your Mungandir, the world serpent? I may have butchered that completely. The South rising again. Fascism. Leading a country to war on false pretenses. The end of all life on Earth. Getting half hard and trying to smoosh it in. A Puerto Rican minotaur from the Bronx. My math teacher's bulge. Sluts, whores, and bitches. Politics. Tar. A toothless woman going on a peach. Pulling a sick... What? No. Why would you even... Twirling a cane, popping it in... What? Again, no. <laughs> uh, these people. But I love the game so much. Alright, last mini deck of cards. None of your damn business. Hunting white men for sport. It's only a matter of time. Pushing my boob up to lick the nipple. Deja vu. Wait, what? I knew I saw this card before. 
Steve, stand up. I know you're blown away by the deja vu. I mean, I knew I'd seen this card before. The boy who sucks the farts out of my school. <laughs> Jesus. A hamburger on a string that keeps getting pulled away. A hateful 30-year marriage. A poop emergency. Hush money. Fat. Suing two hamsters together to make a double hamster supreme. Okay, a little girl with a knife. Travolta. The harsh reality that all horses are people in horse costumes. Huffing and puffing and... <laughs> a bird that dies. A whole different way of talking called Spanish. Hiking up a hillside covered in bear seat yelling on queen. Oh my god. Taking a dump. Carbs. Elon Musk. Why? That No, that's not advisable. At all. Being hunted by giant eagles. Only if it's the third movie. The kind of porn with poop. Korean barbecue. A family of raccoons. The fact that time is moving backwards right now and nobody's noticing. I swear I'd seen this joke before. The pelican that will one day eat Scarlett Johansson's baby. Jeremy and his stupid, annoying, dumb, hard, beautiful body. A couple of cold ones. The coming race war. Hiding from Border Patrol. Prison. Naked Dad. The man in the basement. A little boy with big dreams and potatoes for hands. The world's largest baby weighing over 700 pounds. Ew. I mean, I know people like hollandaise sauce. I just don't like hollandaise sauce. The current political climate. A urinary tract infection. Just a Luna bar for lunch. Chow da. Say it right, Frenchie. Chow da. Oral. Anything Asian. Little Debbie, her mom, full size Deborah. The cutest fucking shoes I've ever seen. And a perfectly, oh my god. 12 foot scepter of bone. Your mouth. Enticing a herbling bird to drink nectar out of my ure. Ow! No! Getting depressed and super fat. Did that! Currently lost 100 pounds. Still working on the next 100. Depressed didn't help. Making direct high contact with a horse's asshole. You're gonna need lotion. Schindler's List. Getting banished to the Shadow Realm. Doing ho shit. Slowly releasing a huge fart over the course of two minutes. Netflix. And a stinky hoo-ha. So there we have 300 cards from Cards Against Humanity, the uh, absurd box with two de two deja vu. So it's 299 cards and one repeat joke, which all in all, I mean, a repeat joke is all right. I'm still surprised it took them to get this long to get to the chicken. Why did the chicken cross the road? So that's all the white cards back in. That's the black cards back in. That is. The Cards Against Humanity Absurd Box, which we're going to keep separate for now. Oh, and the new game, don't forget. Uh, I'll put the link down below for anybody that wants to sign up as well. Dreadfulbookofquestions.horse. I'm going to verify it first, but I'll put the link down below if it's actually legit, which I don't have any reason to doubt these people, because I love the Cards Against Humanity people. Uh, I'm going to move Cubecraft Steve down for a second. I'm going to check the bigger blacker box and see if I have room inside to add the absurd box because we need to verify the size of the collection right now ooh I actually I may or may not have room to put the absurd box into the bigger blacker box Ugh. And I can't even get the whole collection in on camera right now. Move the camera up. That is my Cards Against Humanity full collection there. And I think just about in between, I think these two are filler. So the Absurd Box cards may just fit in here when I put them in. But I'm going to find out after this video. That being said, tip that back down. This box is really, really heavy at this point. 
Come on out, little buddy. That being said, I am Style and Steve. This is the Cards Against Humanity Absurd Box Review, which we've gone through all 300 cards. That is Cubecraft Steve, my little helper. That is Cards Against Humanity. That is my collection in the big black box. And uh, I'll be back around again another time. So until then, I'm out. <laughs>